Welcome to our sugaring hair removal video. We know getting sugared may be intimidating, so we wanted to share with you how easy it really is. For some of you, sugaring is a new form of hair removal, but the concept dates back all the way to the days of Cleopatra. For those that have never been sugared, let's walk you through what a typical appointment would look like. I'm going to be doing your sugaring services today, so just come on back with me. Diane, have you ever been sugared before? No. Okay, so what you're going to do is I'm going to have you undress from the waist down. I'm going to have you lay with your legs facing those curtains, and that little cloth is just a modesty cloth, so you can just cover yourself up, and I'll be back in a couple minutes. least a quarter of an inch long before you get sugared. So if you're shaving, you want to wait about two to three weeks before coming in. Let's get started with our service. We're going to make sure that the area is clean and we're also going to powder it, which is going to help the sugar perform better. The sugar paste is made up of lemon, sugar, and water. As seen above, it looks like a thick honey. The sugar paste is molded into the hair follicle against hair growth and removed with hair growth. This differs from wax. You're going to have less breakage on the hair, more consistent removal, and less ingrowns when your hair grows back in. The sugar is heated to a very low temperature, so you never have to worry about getting any type of burn during a sugaring service. It is also super sanitary. The same sugar is used throughout the appointment and thrown away with the gloved hand. This is something that really sets it apart from other hair removal services. Coming in to get a bikini or Brazilian sugaring can be a little bit awkward, so we do everything that we can to make sure you are as comfortable as possible. Okay, here you go, Diane. This is your hot towel, and it's just to clean up any sugar left over, and that way you don't feel sticky anymore. All right, while Diane's getting dressed, I'm gonna go over the aftercare of sugaring with you. So you wanna wait to exfoliate for the next 24 hours. You basically just wanna wait 24 hours to do anything, no hot tubs, no extra hot showers. You just wanna keep the area clean. Um, after the 24 hours, you do wanna exfoliate and that will help with ingrowns and any um, irritation. You should get sugared every four to six weeks, preferably four. We hope that makes you feel super comfortable coming in and having your sugaring service done at LML, and we look forward to seeing you soon.